Hey guys, so I was actually thinking uh, about this title screen here because I was just, I was sitting on it waiting for the session to start. And um, if you look at it, it their, their distance to the screen, like to our perspective, kind of represents like their, their prominence in the story. Like Star-Lord is first, he's closest, right? The next is Rocket and we've dealt a lot with Rocket, right? where Rocket's having issues and he leaves the team and all that stuff, right? So that's, that's, he's got some stuff. Then, um, then Drax has his stuff with his family and, and Groot's there, but he's not really, you know, like incredibly involved. And, uh, Gamora, I, I would say that they didn't give her enough time until they did the whole thing with her, uh, attacking those people, because she saw the little girl. You know, that that triggered something in her and she attacked and that made sense for her character and it it gave her a little backstory even for a standoffish character who's not going to talk, you know? So I, I think they're doing really, really well with the... Um, they're doing really, really well with the characterization. Like, the writing has been has been fairly well done. I've been very happy with it. And with that in mind, let's continue. I'm really excited to see what the ending looks like. Mantis? What happened on Lamantis after we left? Last time we saw you, things looked dire. It's a long story. We can talk about it after you do like Star Guy says and use the bathroom. I don't need to. All right. But don't say I didn't warn you when church grandpa makes you do faith crunches. Hmm. Wait. Raker's gonna do what? It depends. But at some point... Someone says my name, and then there's a little bit of pee. Great. I did not want to know that. I am Groot. Oh, yeah, little fuzzy. Maybe the little bit of pee is you. Nope. <laughs> Alrighty. Good thinking. Get the watering sorted out before we go. I am Groot. <laughs> he looks so sad. <laughs> the, the what? What what what'd he say? <laughs> Gro Groot wants to water the grand unifier. Oh, right. <laughs> the soaked unifier. <laughs> the, the grand humidity. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I'm not in on the joke because I can't hear what he says. <laughs> All right, let's get ready. Gamora and Huberi, you wish to practice hand-to-hand -hand techniques. It's still weird when you say my actual name. I am getting used to it. We've come a long way since murderous sorceress. Peter Quill, spar with me. I think we already <laughs> did all this stuff. <laughs> uh, I, I think I'll pass, Drax. Because I'd I, probably uh, die. I don't want to get tired before the real fight. This is the warm up. Not a bad idea. We don't know what's going to happen when we get out of hyperspace. What if we get ambushed? Here goes nothing. Eh, no, scratch that. Here go the Guardians of the Galaxy. I'm going to barf. I like their version of hyperspace way better than the one in uh, Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2. Like where it starts warping them and it builds like a hexagonal portal that doesn't make sense it's like no you're going fast it's, you're not it's not a portal gun it's not just making a portal it doesn't make any sense james wrong it's at least thrice as big that's the biggest i've ever seen it oh good what now kill the lights kill the engines wait for lady hellbender to show up we're sure she's coming right she is a woman of honor, a queen. She promised to gather her forces. And how long is that going to take? Too long? No. We can't be too late. We got to save the galaxy and Nikki. One way or another, we need to get in there and shut down that ritual. We can't take on a fleet that big. What if we don't? Little Fuzzy! Rocket, what are you doing, man? 
We need to get into Sacrosanct to disrupt the ritual, right? We all know we get killed out here. So, I'm gonna make a really loud distraction. My tunes! Yeah, I rigged it to blast your scuddy music across all channels. While the church is out looking for the source. We cut the engines and we flow silently right past them toward the Sacrosanct. Smart! Seriously? It's a tape deck. You can get a Zune. It'll be fine. But we're getting it back as soon as My dad had a Zune. Get back in here. This reminds me of Star Trek Beyond for some reason. Remember when they used um, Sabotage from Beastie Boys? It was Sabotage, wasn't it? I'm gonna get my music back once this is all done. Sorry, Quill. Chances are they're gonna blast it to pieces once they pin it down. Let's make sure this I can't steer. But I can actually I can move it, but I can't steer. They're playing Star Lord. Yeah, what they can't hear us if we can talk. I know they're out there, but they can't hear us through the ship's hull. Right. Yet you're still whispering. It's not like Humphrey Red October. Where they could actually hear us through uh sonar. But they can't. What's that sound? It sounds like singing. That's that's from Red October, cause the the super quiet uh, submarine drive was so quiet that they couldn't hear the engines. They could instead hear them singing inside the sub. It's like, oh, that's that's not a good thing to have, cause sonar is the only way we could pick these things up. What? <gasps> Orgon's breath. Whoa! Yes, Lady Hellbender has arrived. With Fin Fang Foom. Guardians of the galaxy, stop hiding! The monster lords of Seknok 9 hunger for battle! We're not hiding. We are sneaking. Because we need to get into Sacrosanct alive. Well, they'll be distracted now. We'll slaughter as many as we can out here while you fight your way in. Eat, my children! Crack open their shells and feast upon the sweet meats inside! <laughs> oh, they're gonna eat all Novacore. Oh no, Novacore's dead now. <laughs> this is so metal. Alright, people, let's take advantage of the nice lady's murdering spree. Let's bust it into Cyberset. That landing bay's in the way. Whoa. Ah, Jeez. Jeez. I should go. Now this is pod racing. That's what you should have said. What is Disney gonna sue you for you doing exactly what they would do? He would say, "No, this is pod racing," and people would say, "What?" And he would go, uh, "Shut up! Don't worry about it." Very damage. Nice. I like those. The gold's a little much, but you know, they, they look nice. Please. We're gonna kill him. 
Mega Billy, gift of the flora. Having learned to tap into his own essence to revive Fing Fang Foom, Groot can now do the same for all incapacitated guardians. Even if you die while your disability is available, Groot will automatically revive you. This is a good thing. Let's roll. Gotta get that sniper. Gotta get that sniper. Aw, oh, come on. Already? Yes. Really missing my tunes right now, Rocket. Right. But they but I had to put it on streaming mode. Are there even okay, there are people here. Plasma. Oh, there they come. He's the ice. Yikes. Alright, alright, alright. What are we doing? What are we doing? This is what I was waiting for. Fireworks! 
All right, and boom. I'm working on it. Keep saying that. <laughs> that guy got an ungodly beating for no reason. Lock him down, group. Do it. Doing it. did four lines for this. Flams. Alright. Let's roll. Mantis, you still alive? When? Uh, now. That's a tricky question. Well, the hard answer is sorry. And there's a lot of faith Scott beaming into this place. He almost kicked our butts when he was all sad and mopey. If they found a way to turn him, we'll just have to go into his mind and fix him too. I ain't jumping into that freak's promise. Can you imagine? Right. Combs and cheap hair product. And tap out t-shirts and Ed Hardy jeans. No spinning. Why is she spinning? Don't worry about my flight. Just worry about your Bam. I really like this enemy too, like a like a galaxy spanning religious sect with with bad intentions. I think that's that's a good, like unique kind of cause cause for like a space opera story, you don't really get that. I mean kind of Star Wars, but not really, because they they aren't really shown as a religious organization for the most part it's it's more along the lines of like a military force like the uh like the empire or the first order or the final order or any of those permutations of just the empire we need to go that way see if you can overload it okay doggy right there electricity shot that's really the cold. Most of course. You just said sorry. He's not Canadian. He's from Missouri. He sounds like me. Right. Oh, 
Highlander may have an opinion on that. We've got to at least get most of the salvage. I mean, come on. Like, half. Like, Hellbender gets half, and we get half. Because we gave her Fin Fang Foom. Hot shot. Up. Imagine the havoc Lady Hellbender must be wreaking outside. Who's probably crushed half the armada by now? Dang it, wrong button. I actually tried on that one. Throw the tracks! Up I am. The matriarch could not save this one! There you go. At least Mantis hasn't crashed the Milano. Not yet! Zap! I love playing Zappazelli! Oh, crap. I didn't realize there was a floor there for a while. Then I jumped, I'm like, oh no, this is, this is a gap. Way bigger than I thought it was. No? Nothing? Okay. We win. We get first chance on all the salvage, right? Let's cross the finish line before we start dividing the spoils. Think they'll tell us where Warlock is? We don't need them to. Tracker's working fine. Must be cold. <laughs> Imagine the havoc Lady Hellbender must be wreaking outside. Probably destroyed half the armada by now, Drax. Only all the hands. Is that what they call you? <laughs> <laughs> oh, that looked silly. You said it, bud. They are gonna throw everything they got at us. And we will dodge it! Warning lights? They're distracting. You just lost your tape privileges. It's my tape. Still looking for collectibles. Still looking for collectibles. I don't think there are any. This is the last level. Oh look! We are being one. Say hi to the Stuff. Fans. Not collectibles. Some of them understand but I mean look at look at all the Look at I still have three more outfits for Star Lord. That's not what I meant. Ugh. I have still three more outfits for uh for 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 Rocket as well. All the outfits for uh Groot are unlocked. She still has two more. He still has one. We still got we we have lots of outfits that we need to find. Oh, I need to open it. Uh But how is door? Yeah, I smell it too. Some kind of culty funk. That's no nose. Yeah, it does. It just ain't where you'd expect it. Oh. Oh no. Well, I bet you can pull up the rest of the battles. Wind shot. Oh. Did you guys get the radioactive plasma bridge or the wind thing this time? Wind thing. The wind thing. Oh, this is the one where you live. Well, at least through this part.
All right. I see it. Wait. This wind shall not break our determination. Determinazione. Yes, I did watch JoJo Part 5 recently. Oh, that's not good. This is bad. go when this ends bum bum just plant those feet in the ground buddy you can do this haha <laughs> plant cause he a tree ships. Well, hi, guys. about masks and stuff if you're out just in space okay. go, go, go. like you guys need to cover your entire body like you can't have skin exposed or explosive decompression is a thing they're not gonna have atmo out here that's stupid and wouldn't work because you'd be constantly bleeding it that's why there's an interior to the ship <laughs> Come on. Shoot him. Oh, great. One of these guys. Yuck. Alright. Take him now, dude. Lock him down. Take him out. Don't get hit by them. Feel this. Wind shot. Can't wait to see your face on a Bam. Man, the entire galaxy showed up for this brawl. 